We're going to start by preparing the berries. Put them in a saucepan with some lemon juice and powdered sugar. Then leave them to cook for about five minutes. Now you need to separate out the berries from their juice. So pour them into a sieve, strain the juice, and then leave everything to cool. It's time to move on to the base. Put the cookies in a food processor, then turn it on to crush them. Then add the melted butter. And run the processor quickly again. Empty the mixture into a lined springform tin and form the base of the cheesecake by flattening the crushed cookies down thoroughly with a spoon. And leave to firm in the fridge for at least half an hour. To make the cheesecake filling, you first need to soak the gelatin sheets in cold water, then heat the heavy cream, and place the softened gelatin into the hot cream. Mix together and leave it to cool. Meanwhile, sieve the ricotta cheese. Combine the ricotta with the fresh cheese. Add the lemon peel and the powdered sugar. Give it all a good mix. Then add in the cream with the cool gelatin. And now we can put our cheesecake together. Spread about half of the cream over the base, which has firmed up by now. Add the berry mixture on top. and pour the rest of the cream over it. it firm up in the fridge for at least two hours. Now you're going to use the leftover berry juice to make the jelly filling. Pour it into a saucepan and then add in the cornstarch. Mix it together and then leave it to cook for five minutes. Once it has cooled down, pour the jelly over the cheesecake. and leave it to firm up in the fridge for another hour. And now it's my favorite moment. Bon appétit.